facilitators on the Tower Academic and I'm going to be facilitating ICT. Uh, to start with, as you can watch on the screen, you are welcome to the Tower Academic and to the world of ICT. And I'm going to take you through the practical paper. ICT has got uh, two papers. That is the uh, paper one, which constitutes of 20 questions, as you will see later, but basically to concentrate on this one, it is paper two with it that paper code S850 stroke two and it consists of five topics whereby each topic carries 20 marks out of the five questions which are set it's upon you to choose the three questions that you can do to your best because all of them carry the same weight now at your inner level you are required to attempt only three questions if you happen to do four only three will be considered. They will not mark all the three questions. Only three questions will be marked. The first one, depending on the examiner. So it's better you choose only three questions that you feel you can do to your best so that you can finish. Uh, to you as a student, as my learner, I at least expect you to be one, self-esteemed, be self-driven, because since you're going to be that side you know what you do so it's upon you to take to make sure that as you are doing some other work you deserve and create more other work for this work you need to be, to be mature and disciplined so that you follow up uh, to start with when it comes to the real practical session we know that a computer consists of different parts but now when it comes to this practical it's basically the keyboard and the mouse so we need to know what is all about the keyboard and how do we use the keyboard and how do we use the mouse so as you can see on the screen you have the mouse which I believe you've been interacting with it so when you look at the mouse we have those three parts uh, the wheel which scrolls up and down the other button the right click if you want to get other options that you feel like then we have the primary button which is the left key so when i say click definitely it is the primary key which is left button then not until i mention right click that's when you can click on that side but depending on what you're doing you can desire to have shortcuts by just right clicking and then you move on so that's the our mouse then also we look at the, this mouse because some of these questions can be asked in paper one. Like they can ask what is clicking, what is double clicking, and what is right clicking. You don't need to cram them, but you need just to know. For example, when you move the mouse and you point over those items, what is that? That is pointing. When I say right clicking, what is it? They want you to explain what it is all about. Pressing and releasing the left button, and this is done mainly as a default by the primary key and then we have double clicking that's pressing and releasing the left button twice in a quick successive interval just in a blink of an eye you have pressed it twice then we have a uh, right click right click is pressing and releasing the right button and select any desired option as i talked about it earlier dragging is moving either a text a file or an object all are for anything that's on screen so long as you press the button on it the, the mouse the, the cursor over it you don't release and then you move it that's what we call dragging and then to move on we go to a scroller that's the wheel which scrolls that gets through the documents upwards and downwards so that's all about the mouse now when the